Hey, it's your boy Daddy from Triple D Gaming coming at you with another FS19. Let's get to it. So, this is just going to be a quick video on how to install mods. Um, third party from without side of the mod hub. Um, so, let's get to it. <clears throat> we, as you see, fs19mods.com. Alright, so I'm going to grab this bulldozer here real quick to show you guys so you just search what you want you got maps buildings objects placeables implements com combines cutters tractors trailers excavators trucks cars vehicles prefab textures packs others all kinds of stuff guys so any website whatever you do you just uh hit download okay and then download file step one uh, Caterpillar D6 winch dozer zip file. That's what we need, guys. Zip file right here. B free download the blue download button. Click on that. All right, you're going to see it down here. It's down here downloading, okay? So that's that. All right. So we're going to jump out of here. All right, guys. And then what you're going to do is you're going to come down to your folder. Um, your file explorer okay and then once you open your file explorer you're going to want to go to I'm gonna make this bigger for a second you want to want to go to your downloads okay right here it is caterpillar d6k uh, wedge dozer and then an attachment blade dozer now I got to shrink that back down for a second I'm gonna snag a hold of those and set them on the desktop set it on the desktop all right now what you're going to want to do is you're going to come to your documents hit your documents my games farming simulator 19 and then right here's your mod folder okay so if you open that up that's all your mods that that you have in the game even ones from the mod hub all right so we're going to back back to the mods right there's your mods folder all right i'm going to shrink that back down and you can open these up guys um and this is how it should look there should be a couple folders and then your xml files so you could open them and actually change stuff within the machine like that's uh five thousand five hundred dollars you could actually make that zero if you wanted to um you uh anything you really uh can't do like changing the, the speed and the power of the machine you can do it but that's a whole nother video it's not as easy as just changing the speed um so let's get back to this so you're gonna exit out of that all right so all you're going to do guys is you're going to grab a hold of this file pull that back over you're going to grab a hold of that file and just hover it over top of your mods folder and drop it grab that hover it over your mods folder and drop it all right now if you open that up there they are right there okay so i'm gonna go ahead and close that out and then I'm gonna go ahead and open the game all right guys and once you're inside the game you just hit your career uh, click your save game all right and then we're gonna scroll down to our mods here until we find it Right here, the Caterpillar D6 winch dozer. We're gonna click on that. All right, and then here's our blade, guys. The dozer blade. We're gonna click on that. Hit start. And then we wait. That was actually pretty quick. All right, so. We're going to go to the store. I'm not exactly 100% sure. You just got a, uh, oh, it's actually a four string machine, so it should be in there. Yes, there it is. All right, so 200,000 bulldozer. I left the price alone. I didn't mess with the price. Uh, there she is. So we're going to purchase that. And then I'm hoping this blade even goes to this dozer, but we're about to find out. Alright, so we're going to head on over to the store, fire our bulldozer up, and there 
it is, guys. I don't know how this thing works, actually. Uh, it's just that simple. actually have a winch on this too. Uh, okay, we can't. See, I don't like that. There was another dozer blade in that mod hub. We're going to have to get that because this one here actually doesn't match this thing. So, but there it is, guys. I mean, it's that simple. If you like what you see, uh, hit that like button. Uh, if you want to see what's coming, what's next, hit that subscribe button, and I'm out.